We were on day two with MAO. Uh, last night stayed in a Shan village and today we're trekking by the river. Well, trekking by the river, in the river, floating in the river. It's actually a pretty cold day. It's winter time and we're up in the mountains. Bye bye. And uh, when it was time to go, bye. the whole village came to uh, say goodbye to us. <laughs> yeah, literally bye. the whole village, not even kidding. And before we jump ourselves into that cold river, a little hot spring spa with some friends. Well, Tyler's friends, really. Although this friendship might be a little bit one sided. Oh no! <laughs> oh, it's really hot. Now I know what a hard boiled egg feels like. Hey, what do you think it is? Uh, jungle cat. Jungle cat. It's uh, it looks like a house cat, but it's more skinny. But it's higher. Uh huh. Yeah, big. Longer legs. Bird. This is uh, maybe jungle cat. Like the chicken legs, the paw print. But bigger. <laughs> are, you, are you gonna dive in as well? Okay. Here, now you can hunt them. Here we go. Floating on by. to see sunshine. <laughs> Trekking by the river, in the river, floating in the river and now we've stopped for some lunch. Lunch is serious business for MAO, right? One of the things that I've been pleasantly surprised traveling through Myanmar is just how good the food actually is. Sometimes even when it's so simple, look, it's like sticky rice from the Shan village we stayed at last night, a bit of fried okra and the kind of pork curry, but so tasty. <laughs> Warm this up a little bit before we need to go back in this really cold river. The sun's coming out. Oh, his rain dance worked. It's cold. I'm peeing right now, it's warm. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Going out cold water just after we've been warmed up by the sun and the fire is refreshing. <laughs> So that relatively easy hike yesterday I think has lulled us into a slightly false sense of security because this river is hardcore. So 
as you can see, a few of us volunteered to be in the back of the truck. Well, we didn't realise quite how dusty it was. And after a long, very wet day, we're off to another Shan village for the night and get some rest before tomorrow's activities. We go mountain biking and we discover one of the most amazing waterfalls I've ever seen in my life. So make sure you're subscribed to my channel and see you in the next video. As always, if you've enjoyed this video, do show it some love by hitting the like button below. And if you're not already subscribed, do also hit the subscribe button right now for more adventures in unusual places. See you next time.